Hi, my name is Wendy Van Nickel. Welcome to my show that I got with the development deal. And I got this pool, and I got a pair of diesel jeans, and I got an iPod that works. I'm here with Amber Testonado. Amber Testonado has been crashing pools for years, maybe centuries. Yes, Let's see what she has to up. say. Oh. It up. Here's Amber now. <laughs> How does it feel to land in the water that way with your body so captured and torn and mid-flight? I feel, I feel like I'm crashing this pool, you know? You feel like you're crashing. So this is really, like when you're doing that, you actually feel like you're fulfilling your life's purpose. Where? When? Why? Yeah, like the backflip is the finale of my crash. Now, because you have such beautiful hair, what can you recommend a shampoo for other women to use? Well, you gotta use whatever they have in their house. Amber, how many pools have you crashed this week? Seventeen. This is my seventeenth pool. Where? I did the one next door, and then I did two in the neighborhood adjacent to this neighborhood. Great. They're vacationing together. These people and those people. Three, two, one. Wow. Now, what was your first experience? Do you remember it vividly? Your first time actually submerging yourself into the shockingly cold and foreign waters of somebody else's pool? First time. The first time it was an accident. Like, I didn't know I was crashing the pool. Like, I thought it was my friend's house, but it wasn't. Right. And um, then my friend was like, hey, my house is over here. I can't imagine somebody actually being angry finding you. You know, if they came home from the vacation or they were wintering, you know, maybe in the Riviera and they came back to find you in the pool, I would think that they would find it to be a pleasant surprise. Really? Absolutely. This has been such a pleasure interviewing you, Amber. Thank you so Thank much you. for being on the show. You want to come swimming? Love to. I'm about to dive in. Whoa. Please join us again. <laughs>